I remember saying this when um, we're, our, our um, <clears throat> 5G UC was coming to play. I remember telling you that, um, you know, each carrier will be at a gigabyte eventually, right? Verizon, AT&T, T-Mobile, and, and now they are. You've, you've right? been saying this probably since 2020 when N41 launched. You said the future in mid-band is gigabit speed. Yes, right, right. And so we're there. We're there, right? So the next frontier is going to be like, you know, 10 gigabyte, then, you know, then 100 gigabyte, right? Um, and now, since we had the one gigabyte with satellite, right? This is this is great news. Like, I, I, I am ecstatic. Like, this is this is so cool um, to have this actually happen. Because here's here's the other, here's the other thing. The other satellite players, we're talking about Viasat. Um, <coughs> ASTS is pretty exciting. They seem to be doing a lot of good things. Yeah, um, AST is good, but we want we want the thing here is right. We don't want you know. I mean, for me personally, we don't want to, we. It's great that Elon's doing all the work. Okay, we don't want just him doing all the work. Yeah, I want, we want I like want, seven. I want bias that to do to up their game. <laughs> yeah, it's expensive, right? But I want right. other satellite players to get in the game, have competition, just like the carriers are doing. So, but you know, um, I think this is great. Good job, Elon. Other satellite guys like Viasat, you know get off your keister and work a little bit harder <laughs> oh the legacy satellite guys look terrible elon's no, running laps yeah. around them right oh, hey yeah the biosat well, they, yes, yes, yeah everybody else yeah let's, need... let's 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 be honest before we talk about other companies in the satellite world needing to do more why don't the American people get off their keisters and <laughs> invest in those companies? Like, we do no, a lot of talking. I agree. Like, put you, your money where your mouth is. Hold on, like, B. Oh, how am I supposed to... How can I invest in a private company? What do you mean? I can't invest in Starlink. It's private. Of course you can invest in Starlink. Why, I mean, why, I mean, you can I have to invest in Tesla. In Tesla. You, have the you have the... You have... Okay, so do it. You have the ability... But, right. Like not talking. You know what, about B? I'm gonna go ahead and put in. It, a, I'm gonna put in an order for. Dude. I'm gonna they're buy a share. They're trading there 400 <laughs> bucks already. People are already investing in Tesla. Right. But I'm talking specifically about the other care, the other carriers, the other companies that are in the satellite world. Like, if people want competition, well, put your money where your mouth is. Yeah. Like, <laughs> you go invest for them. You, you always seem to blame yeah. the American. Whenever the whenever a company is behind or whenever a company messes up, you're always the first guy to blame the American. Why are you blowing down oh, yeah, on us, B? The, the, the American people I, but, simulate. The American because, people this. The American people vote Because with it's, the the people it's the truth. It's the truth. <laughs> if you if you want if you want to see if you want to see a company invest in something, there's got to be money there to do it. And Many of the satellite companies. Starlink, are you saying Starlink isn't getting customers? Are you saying they're not successful? I'm not even talking. So I'm not even talking about Starlink. I was talking about the other companies in that particular realm. Oh, I see yeah. what you're Those saying. Those are the okay. companies gotcha. that could okay. use the capital. There you go. To okay. be able to grow and compete, like so. So let me start over. Maybe I wasn't as articulate as I could have been. Let me try again. You're clear. I'm like not talking about Tesla. I'm talking about all the other companies that compete in that space. Gotcha. If we yeah. want them to compete with a company that's trading at $400 a share, it's probably fair to put our money where our mouth is and invest in the other companies as well. Does good that take. make sense? Yeah, you know yeah good, good take, B. Yeah, I agree okay. with you 100%. Okay, all right. That's yeah, what I'm trying to say. A little bit. Yeah, it'd be like, hey, guys, you know that $10 stock that's in the sky? <laughs> Wait, I so you, so you want me to buy shares of Global Star, bro? Two dollars right. a share, yeah. dog. I'm saying, I'm saying, <laughs> like, yo, if, if we, if you want them to compete, because if you, if you don't, yeah, I'm with you. If it's a joke, then no, no. it's gonna stay the way it is. Right now, Starlink is doing what it's doing because it pretty much has unlimited capex to be able to do the types of things that are that are being done, and they gotta end with the guy who's about to go in the White House of Pennsylvania. I mean. Yo, what be it, you know, right you know what, you know what's crazy is like if you if you look at like what's going on within the industries, nobody can do anything without Starlink's Falcons. Like they can't launch their satellites without Elon. He's the guy. I don't know. If I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. If that's, I don't know if that's true. Like, no, that is, that I understand. Is true, I mean, actually, that is true because I like he's the only guy that could scale launches like twice a week. Yeah, so like for example, example here be like um, I was um, Amazon on their Origin Space program. They're actually using SpaceLink's uh, uh, boosters, right? You know, SpaceX boosters, right? So a lot of people use them. Actually, it's good. There, there, there's, there's, does, there's another SES company. There's another. I'm sorry, I apologize. There's another company 
that does satellite launching. I forgot what. But it's are they called. doing it better than Elon? I'm not saying they're doing it better. Uh, they're probably not trading at 400 bucks, guys. So <laughs> all right, so I understand what you're saying. I get it. The 800 pound gorilla is Starlink. I understand. I heard you. Okay, I'm not disagreeing with you. What I'm saying is there are other players in that space. And if you want those guys to do the same thing, it's probably going to take some additional investment. I'm with you. But I mean, yeah. I, I think that there is other another company that that does satellite launches and things like that. I just don't remember what it's called. I'll research it. I, I'm sure I'll remember it as soon as I get off the call. But there are other players there. There are other players. No. I'm, I'm waiting to see what AST does. Yeah, they've me too. Some significant investment, right? I know they're going to be getting their stuff off the ground. There's going to be other well, they've got the right guys other... invested in them. B, they've got Verizon and AT and T. I mean, they're yeah, I they're. Mean, I think they're in the catbird seat to succeed with respect to that. They'll be fine. Yeah. At the end of the day, the technology is what the technology is. The money's only going to get you so far. And I mean, to be honest, as great as Starlink's technology is, it sounds like everything is just kind of, you know, aspirational. They haven't really provided gigabit speeds anyone yet to my knowledge so i don't know how they're going to do that without creating interference out the out the wazoo but maybe well, they those know frequencies something I don't. those frequencies i mean that i mean nobody terrestrial is doing anything in those frequencies we'll see what happens um i i, I don't know man we'll see what happens I, right. i'm not sure but okay. what i do know is the carriers aren't resting on the well most of them are resting on the low. So. <laughs> oh, you're terrible, Doug. <laughs> who is? Who is? Well, I don't want to. I, I know who's not. I'll, I'll put it that way. So I, I don't want to go down well, that road because I don't well, feel you, like. You, you know who's not. 